Hey, YouTube people. Well, I'm back here again. I want to try something. Uh, I'm currently, the gas light just came on. Um, I want to try to see a real world review with gas mileage. Uh, nothing scientific, of course. So I'm going to try and, you know, work this out as how I see fit with my everyday life. Um, we're gonna, we're, we are house hunting right now and things like that. So we are driving a little bit more around highway and city. Um, I'm just curious to see what kind of MPG I'm actually getting. And I'm going to reset the average, uh, MPG here. And I want to see what we end up getting. Uh, once I, I'm going to fill the truck up. Remember I do have the 33 gallon tank, so it takes a little bit longer for that to uh, run out, but I'm going to fill it up. I'm gonna uh, total up my city miles and my highway miles. And I will also, I wanna see what that average says at the end of the 33 um, gallons once it's full, or once I'm on E again. So I'm about to fill up here now. And once I come to E again, I guess I'll add on to the video and uh, let, let everyone know how it went. So. I guess this will, no, it won't be a two part. I'll just mix all this in together to make one video. I am gonna get 89 octane. I believe that's what the manual uh, states is suggested. So I'll do that. 87, if you put 87 in a truck, it's not gonna blow up. So I know most people do 87, but I'm gonna use the recommended um, gas and see if that makes a difference with MPG. So. I'll get back with you guys and let you know how it turns out. Seven point three gallons in, seventy-two dollars later. Let's see uh, how this ends up. Rest this right here, and y'all are gonna learn with me how to reset everything. We're gonna scroll up. Trip info. I'm gonna reset everything. Hold OK to reset. Boom. Reset YouTube. Boom. OK, I'll reset. Now, how do I reset my average MPG? Let's find out. Oh, there we go. Hold to reset. That wasn't too hard. Hope y'all can see that. Maybe I need to get that closer. Well, as you can see, I just reset it. So as I idle, as I'm sitting here idling, it's literally going down. But all right, let's get going. I'll get back with you guys uh, once I'm once I'm on E. Uh, as you can see, my range right now is 494 miles on this in, with this 33 gallon tank on 89 octane. I'll get back with y'all. We'll see how long it takes me to burn this uh, tank of gas. Peace. See you in a little bit. Hey guys, looks like the fuel light should be coming on any minute now. There it goes. Perfect timing. And I'll calculate all this information up and let you know what I came up here with. See you in a minute. Hey YouTube people, I'm sitting here in my garage and I just completed what I would call, I guess, a real world test. Not very scientific, but something that means something to me. Um, basically, I wanted to see what kind of MPG I was really getting, um, how close to the sticker price, it, or to sticker price, to the sticker the MPG was, uh, things of that and such. I have uh, the V8 non e-torque um, RAM, 
I have a 321 gears, so nothing, nothing, you know, too special. Uh, I do have 22 inch wheels and tires, so that will, I'm sure, affect the uh, sticker MPG. But uh, basically, what I did was I went read, read through the manual to see what everything what was recommended. They recommend the tires be at 36 psi cold. Uh, I think 89 octane is what uh, they recommend to fill up at the tank. So I waited for my vehicle to go on E and I drove to the gas station as it hit E. Once I got on E, I filled it all the way up. I, I do have the 33 gallon tank, FYI. <clears throat> uh, typically I can go about three to four weeks on that before I have to go to the gas station and fill up again. But I went, at the time of my fill up, I was at 14.9 MPG. That's what I was averaging. I wanted to see what really was going on and what I would really be getting. So I reset everything and I calculated every time I went to, what is that buzzing sound? I calculated every time I got on a freeway and how much freeway miles I did, how much city and total such and such. So once the tank was filled up, I traveled, I ended up traveling total of 430 miles, which that said, um, 251.7 of those miles were only highway and 178.6 were city miles. which ended up giving me an average once that tank had run out, giving me an average of 16.3 miles per gallon. It held at 17 most of the time, right at 17.1 average. But uh, just recently I did a little bit more city driving. It uh, kind of went down a little bit, but 16.3, and the total mileage 430. So uh, I learned something from it. Maybe that gives you guys an idea of of what you're working with. Um, yeah, I guess I did good compared to before. I was getting 14.9. I oh also I didn't go over 70 miles an hour on a freeway. That that's one thing I tried to keep it at so I could stay consistent. Never went over 70. Um, I'm sure if I kept it under 65, maybe we would have saw a little bit better MPG. But I think what really gets this truck is in the city. You know, it just, it's it's just not meant for it. So if you're looking for gas mileage, you're probably in the wrong vehicle. But I'm just trying to really see what we're really working with. I've always kind of been curious. And uh, that's what uh, prompted me to do this little test. Uh, not sure if you guys learned anything today. I did just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, it took me about a week to do this actually about 10 days. Exact. It took me about 10 days before I was from E to E again. And that's not cause I drive a, a lot because you typically, like I said, a full tank, 33 gallon tank can take me about three to four weeks. But in this particular case, we're home shopping. So we've been driving uh, all around different cities looking for homes and, and it's yeah, some of you, most of y'all, y'all know how it is. So we've been doing that. It was spring break. We had a different event every day for the kids, escape rooms and paintballing and movies. And so we've just been on the go, go, go. Uh, so that's what really ate up the uh, the gas. But uh, anyways, guys, if y'all have any questions, feel free to give me a holler. Um, take it easy.